Now, over 100 years, the white dome that houses Percival Lowell's own 24-inch refracting telescope has been a common sight for people in downtown Flagstaff, but that dome has lay empty for most of this past year. The Clark Telescope has been undergoing an extensive renovation, and now it has returned home. This weekend marked the inaugural first tour of the telescope, so I went out to Lowell this Saturday to bring you inside the newly repaired and reopened dome. It's exciting to be able to reopen the Clark Telescope after almost two years of restoration. The Clark Telescope was first installed in 1895. Now, after a top-down restoration, it's once again open for tours. For more than a year, the antique refractor has been in the capable care of Ralph Nye, the telescope guy, who talked to us about the renovation last August. All of the uh, parts that are brass on the telescope, even the parts that were painted silver, uh, have been cleaned off and buffed out, so every piece of brass that's on this telescope is, is a piece of jewelry. It's a, it's a pleasure to work on this and a privilege, and especially now, rebuilding the whole telescope and redoing the whole dome. It's, uh, it's going to be beautiful and probably the best looking telescope than any other <laughs> refracting telescope in the nation. And many would say that Nye delivered on his promise, as Saturday afternoon the 120-year-old telescope was re-welcomed to the observatory by a fresh batch of visitors. We had a large group of people flood into the dome and spread out and take plenty of pictures. But Lowell's Josh Bengal tells us that it'll be about a month before you'll get your chance to look through the freshly polished Clark Telescope. So you'll get an opportunity to actually look through this very famous telescope just like our founder Percival Lowell and our director VM Slifer had their opportunities to do that as well. So you can actually become a part of history, Lowell's history and the Clark's history here on October 3rd.